this video i'll be talking about how to implement web view in flutter like this this is my home page and if you will click on this button it will redirect to you this website which is google.com like this this is the website and suppose if you type anything right here like flutter tutorial this is the website related with flutter and i will also handle the proper back navigation as well from this button and this button also okay so without any detail let's get started and if you are new here please subscribe to my channel and like the video so first of all you will have to use this package for that web view flutter Okay, and also you will have to check your compile SDK version not less than 32 and minimum SDK version not less than 19. Okay, so first of all, this is my home screen. So basically, this screen there is an elevated button, and on the tap of it, I'm moving towards web view screen. So basically, this is my screen, right? Okay, so first of all, that I have taken here is this value because whenever we are pressing this button there is some loading happening and then my web view page is loaded okay so for that i just want to tell you that i have taken scaffold app bar uh, then i have taken stack here for loading purpose if you don't want that you can leave it and inside that i have used web view widget this is from the same package inside that javascript mode you will have to keep it unrestricted and on progress i have checked the value if value is 100 then set state will call and is loading will be false initially it is true and now it will be false and it will again set state so my build build method will run again and this time it will check if loading is true or false if it is uh, false then it will run this stack so basically this stack and our web view will load okay so let's run it this is my web view i'm searching for flutter and now when i will place this back button it will react to this screen okay so i will handle this now so for that first of all i will have to wrap this stack with will pop scope widget and will pop scope widget will have compulsory property which is on will pop okay so inside this i will I have declared this uh, code. First of all, we will have to declare this web view controller. Okay. And inside this condition, I am checking this web view controller dot can go back. Web view controller dot go back. Then it is returning false. Otherwise, it is returning true. Okay. And also, I will have to apply this code on app bar because there is another option uh, so that a user can back from this icon also so i will apply the same i'm taking leading button ink well navigator dot pop on else child as icon so that is it and lastly i will have to this web view controller inside here inside this web view widget like this okay so that is it let's run the app once again it is run let me search like flutter tutorial to search it everything is going fine from here also so that is it from this video and if you like this video please subscribe to my channel
and hope to see you next time in our next video thanks for now